a Sony HVR-S270E with the uh, video out connector loose. Uh, it's located here down right here and uh, And that's it there at the top. Let's see if you get that. You can see it's loose. What I've got to do now is take off this side casing here to get access to this. Well, first of all, the uh, first thing we want to do is going to remove the battery first. Then the lens. Keep get them out of the way. Start removing the screws here from the side casing. I'm also going to remove this uh, pad from the bottom. Okay, I'm going to release this uh, recording device. And uh, we have two screws in here. And there's one cable down in here. There you go. And clips here, you just pull back the connector and it comes out. Now we can see our connectors. And I've got to get in at that connector now. Also going to have to remove this side as well. It's a same process. I'm not going to um, video the whole taking of all the screws out. So I'm just going to pause it and I'm going to let you see when I have all the screws out. We have a screw down here. Mm. 
and another one down here. Very tight. I've not done one of these before. Hoping I hadn't got to do that, but uh, yeah. now we've got a bit of access to uh, the plugs, they're holding this in place. here like an SDI plug go on that little fly cable and we got this cable here we'll plug that out and we got these two cables here Sold off the rear of these connectors. I removed all my solder. So what I'm going to do now is take out these two screws. I didn't show the desoldering process as it was too time consuming. I'm going to see can I repair this This is actually broken at this point here. I've removed the 41 and I've installed a new uh, connector out from a scrap panel. I have a scrap uh, connector panel and I've just, these just slide out. They'll just slide out that way and they'll just pop out. And um, I should get me out without. Um, buying any expensive connectors. Uh, what I have to do now is clean up this PCB of all that flux and start putting it back together again. All is cleaned up. Make 
make sure it's all the way down. Um, get my two screws. Now we're in this position, now we can start soldering the connectors back in place. Okay, just going to clean it up a bit. Alcohol, get the flux removed from the connectors. Start pulling it in. I'm going to put the cable on the PCB. This plugs directly in. We have some screws to go in here to the front. Now I'm going to put this cable back in here. And then we have this one here. I'll put these two cables in first. In this cap connector cable. And we got this power cable. And then we have this SDI cable here that goes into this board here. I have four screws here to hold this uh, button housing on. Oops. That's one in. And we have one here. Okay. 
and we have another one in here. Next item to go on is this uh, side housing and we got uh, all these cables to go into connectors down here. So I'm going to feed them through. going to hold the house him at one screw while I'm trying to get those cables uh, into the uh, connectors at the bottom. And as you can see here they are. I get this so you have a view and at the same time I'll be able to put this cable in. Got to get these in straight because if I don't, they will um, damage the end of the cable. Okay, that's them in. And uh, we have screwed going down here. I'm going to put this uh, side panel on and there's one cable that's got to go in here and there's a, I just don't know if you can pick it up there or not but just slides into that connector. So that one. All I really ha now have to do is put all my screws on here and uh, put my shoulder pad on and then we shall be ready for testing. I will uh, get back to you as uh, soon as I have all the screws in. 
have my shoulder pad on and my two side panels now. Um, I'm going to put on this recording device now. And of course we got to put our lens on. Dust away. That's my lens in place. And of course, we have our battery to go back in as well. Have a lead connected the, the video out now. And uh, as you can see, it's uh, right there. That was the damaged connector. Um, I'm just going to get a shot of the uh, uh, monitor screen. This is a shot of the monitor screen now. And uh, I can put my hand in front of the camera. And that's me zooming in and out of the actual camera. Um, so that uh, has been a successful repairs and uh, no parts required. Um, hope that's have helped uh, the some uh, one out there. Uh, thanks for watching.